Hello everybody, I'm Kim McMahon and I'm here with Jeremy. He is one of the winners that we are going to be presented a, an award here at the Digital Security by Design Beacon Award. Mm -hmm. So Jeremy, thank you for joining. Um, give, it, give us a short introduction of who you are. Tell our listeners who you are. Thanks Kim. Hello everybody. My name's Jeremy Singer and I'm a lecturer in the School of Computing Science at Glasgow University in Scotland. Excellent, excellent. So tell us a little bit about um, the submission you gave. Like where did you get the idea for for the new secure design that you submitted for the award? Sure, so we're working with the Python programming language which is one of the most popular scripting languages in the world at the moment and um, we're using a cut down version of Python called MicroPython. Um, it's very popular on small scale systems, things like uh, you know Raspberry Pis and Arduinos and things like that. Mm -hmm. um, but we are porting it to the secure Morello platform, uh, running with Cherry BSD, and um, it was a really nice experience. And I think we've developed what is the first um, secure Python interpreter for Cherry. That is exciting. That's really exciting. So. Um, what is the impact that you expect to, to see in the in, in the industry or in the users from your innovation? Yeah, I think um, Python is just growing in its adoption. Everyone's using it, and um, if people want to use Python on secure platforms, then they'll be able to uh, run with our interpreter and a wide range of libraries, and they can be confident that their code is. Well, I wouldn't say unhackable, but certainly memory safe and more mm -hmm. uh, more um, secure in terms of the kind of vulnerabilities that afflict current insecure software systems. Yeah, that's excellent. And then, um, you know, what's next? I mean, you have this. Can anybody, can you get access to it? Can you use it? Oh, or? yeah. So our MicroPython for Cherry is available on GitHub at the moment. Um, it's also going to be available on the um, Cherry BSD package system soon. So you can say package 64C install MicroPython and our code will get automatically installed on your system. And what we're hoping soon is that when these uh, small scale Cherry embedded boards come out, Cherry IoT and things like that, that we'll be able to run MicroPython on those mm -hmm. as well, which will make them very um, accessible for uh, uh, you know beginner developers to write Python code for um, IoT systems and run it in secure environments. Oh my god, that sounds amazing! Uh, as as the world is just going that way, and any time that you say beginning developers and making it easier, you yeah. know, I love that. I absolutely love that. Yeah. Um, I think. Sorry, just to interrupt. Sorry, yeah. the, the BSD um, ecosystem is yeah. uh, really nice for uh, people. Oh yeah, what's going to ask you? Oh, <laughs> tell me. Go uh, ahead. Tell us about script. it. Tell us about it. Tell us about it. Okay. So um, yes, my name is Jeremy, and I'm a former Linux user. And uh, yes, no, I still do use Linux sometimes, but I've I found uh, coming to Cherry and the BSD ecosystem, it's a really nice uh, development platform. Um, it's a really good way to um, uh, have code running in a nice, uh, secure and um, uh, well-managed ecosystem. And um, yeah, we've really enjoyed working with Cherry BSD. Excellent, excellent. It was easy to work with. Yeah. I love that. Yeah. I love that. Um, so, if somebody wants to follow along with the progress, you mentioned your GitHub repo, so we will get that and include that in this uh, video. Yeah. Okay. Um, but is there any other any other way that people can follow along and with your progress well, and the work ooh, innovations you're doing? We've written some academic papers, uh -huh. um, and we've also got a podcast series. There we go. I'm going to have All to right. my podcast. Please yes. do. Yeah. Okay. Check out capabilities for coders wherever you get your podcast from and uh, you'll be able to find out more information there and we will include that link on, well, on our website Cheers. as well so thank you so much jeremy yeah. for joining us Lovely and to talk to you. yeah and uh, we will talk with you later during the awards mm -hmm. thank yeah. you okay cheers bye cheers.